feels wrong to say that. Hello YouTube world, it's been a long time since I've done one of these, so yeah, I'm well excited. Oh yeah, and sorry, hello, if you don't know me, you're just seeing me for the first time, welcome, my name's KD. But for all of those who do know me and know exactly what's to come, welcome back, love. So yeah, today we have some Hexacan Remo Chemo. Is that how you say it? Because like, I don't really like saying that word. But if that's what it's called, that's what it's called. This is a 21%. And I'm trying to find whether it is a hybrid or not. And I can't find it on the tub. So I'm going to look on the site and shove it down now. All right. So now you know what it is. I'll also tell you that I did not just get this as a delivery today. I also got some Phoenix skyberry kush and mimosa orange punch these are by the new upstate which is from uh, my clinic alternaleaf i'm not sure whether you can get these in the other clinics because i know that this kind of comes from montu so be on the lookout in the next couple of weeks for these reviews too okay so back to the remo i'm not going to say the last part because i just don't like it so we're going to call it remo and I'm going to open it. This is the first time that I've actually had something from Hexacan in a very long time. Um, and the reason being is because the last thing that I got, which I think was the Frosted Lemon Angel, if I'm not mistaken, let me know down below if that's not right. Uh, but I'm pretty sure I had the Frosted Lemon Angel from Hexacan and it wasn't great. So I haven't really touched them since. But this was actually a decent price. So I thought, you know what, we'll give it a go. So I've, I've took off the top and I've teared off the top, but there's not, there's not a massive hit. There's not a massive hit. Let me look. All right. It, it doesn't look as, as bad as I kind of thought. It might have <laughs> it's not that bad. I'm looking in, in the, at the bottom though. There seems to be definitely a lot more shake than I would be used to on um, recent prescriptions. But y'all know what's coming, yeah? Let me go and get the white paper. We'll have a little bit of a deep dive on the white paper. Okay. It's pretty dark. It is pretty dark. Um, It's all right, though. Like, it's all right. There's not that much shake. I, I thought there'd be a lot more, but actually getting it out, there's not that much shake looking at it. It's fairly dry. There's still a little bit of squish in there, like, but, you know, I'm sure a Vida packet would be able to sort that out. It's not bad. It's not too, like, sticky, as in twiggy. The density is not too bad. It kind of looks like your standard six pound a gram strain, to tell you the truth. So, those of you who don't know, I will have a short that is pinned as a comment where you can look at exactly what I'm looking at right now. But if you are a member of the green tier, which is the lowest tier of my memberships, like £2 a month, you're able to see this in its entirety. I put it out the day before. Um, and I'm also going to start doing like extra little bits and pieces as well for my members to do with things like this. Just, you know, give you some extra, some extra content in regards to this. So, yeah, check the short out to see what I'm looking at here. But it doesn't really matter. I can look at it all day long, but without actually trying it, we don't know. So let me put the kettle on. I will get myself medicated. And this is a great opportunity to test this because I ran out pretty much last night. Um, so this is going to be first hand look without any kind of tainting beforehand. Right. So we're going to check it out. We'll see how it goes. Later. All right. I'm back. And I'm conflicted. Let me tell you why. So, when I put it out onto the white paper, I genuinely, like, turned my nose up at it. And I was like, well, this is dry. This looks like it's going to be awful. But, medicating, the flavour was very much on point for me. And I'll show you why right now. Those who know, know. If you're new around here, my go-to terpene is limonene. And that's a shit ton of limonene in here. Immediately, I was like, oh, okay, yeah, the flavour's there, actually. All right. 
and it took me back to Hindu Kush. And I know that Chiron Hindu Kush is now back at Medbud, but I've asked my clinics to see if they could get hold of it, and they can't at the moment. So this actually is a good comparison to that. However, this is why I'm conflicted. It's very harsh. It is very harsh indeed. If it didn't have such that feeling on your throat, that would probably be my next go-to during the day. This is an indica hybrid, which is perfect for me because sativas don't touch me at all. However, this is a nice balanced one for me to have during the day and then bump it up to a full indica at night. For £5.50 a gram, it's all right, but that that harshness that it brings through, like, how many of you have had this? Do you understand what I'm saying? Was it too harsh for you? This was made in Portugal, so this could be why. We know the issues with Portugal-grown stuff, and so this could be why. That's why I'm conflicted. Like, I am conflicted. I don't know whether I should recommend this one or not. Like, for me personally, I love the flavour. It's really, really nice. But the harshness is stopping me want to repeat buy. But it's £5.50, so if you want to give it a go as 10 grams on your next script, it's 55 quid. Do you know what I mean? So if you're happy to spend the 55 quid knowing that it could be a little bit harsh for you, but the flavour's there, the effects are there for me personally, and it could be for you. But yeah, I honestly, this is the first time where I've, ever, I've been like super conflicted. I honestly don't know. I don't know if I'm going to get this again. I don't know. Let me know what your thoughts are, because I don't really have much else to say about this. <laughs> Tell you the truth. I hope you've enjoyed the video. It's been a long time since I've done one of these reviews, but as I said, I've got another two packets that got delivered today, so in the next couple of weeks, I will be filming those. Look after yourselves, look after each other. If this is the first time you've seen me, I'd very much appreciate if you've got any value out of this to hit the subscribe button. We're doing really, really well at the moment. Welcome to everybody that's come along. And above all else, if you just want to help by hitting the like button and commenting, it's of course free of charge. And it helps tell YouTube that you like this sort of content, so it will push it out to more people. And hopefully my channel will grow. <sighs> take care of yourselves, take care of each other.